welcome to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Tasia and my pronouns are she, her, and hers. And if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. So for today's video, I am doing a what's in my bag video. I actually haven't seen these be done in a while, but I remember these were one of the videos that I was really, really nosy and excited to watch. I want you to know what is in my bag as a graduate student. So without further ado, Let's just hop right in. So first and foremost, here's my bag. Um, we'll just start at the outside. I have a trans pin on here, like the trans flag, and then a little domestic violence pin on here. But yeah, so that's what's on the outside. And then it has this little button top, which is like cute, but then it's like also a zipper as well. So, let's unzip this and see what we pull out. So when you first open it up, you literally see like Oh, I wish I could show you. It literally looks like this. Can you see that? So I have like my laptop planner and folders on one side and then the rest of the stuff on the other side. The downside about this is like I want, I like having a pocket on the outside. Like you ever seen those bags where it's like the outside has like a pocket right here. Like I like having that because I like to put all my pens and pencils just right in there. But that is okay. I work with what I have. I'm thankful that I even have a backpack and I even can go to school. So first and foremost, I have my keys um, with my ID on here. Yep, my little sister's on here too. Yeah, nothing great about that. Next, um, I have two of these little bags. Um, one's a Sephora bag. And it's just filled with like pens and pencils and all that stuff and highlighters just so I, write, I have them all together. This bag, it's similar with the pens and pencils thing, but I also have ways to like organize myself. So I have like big like, I forgot what these are called. I have big like paper clips and then little um, of these like little pins, like folder, I don't even know what the heck these are called, but they're cute. And they're all like different colors. So I have different colors of these. I actually got this for Christmas from my internship, which was really, that was wild. What the heck? No, I'm like hurting myself. Let's get it right this time. I got these for my internship. Um, they gave it to me as a little gift because I knew I was going to be at school for the holidays and I felt really bad about it, but they also are very appreciative of the work that I do there. So very grateful for them. Shout out to the Cope office. Next, I always have a little, um, notebook on me um just in case i have to take quick notes really fast so i like having a little one this is like more so for work so i'll write in like every monday um we have our judicial meeting so i'll just bring this little notebook in with me and a pen and then like write notes about the judicial meeting what i need to do what i need to conquer for that day in regards to like judicial issues that i have in my building so that's one half of my bag we'll move on to the next half which is all closed and concealed Every time I have my backpack, I have my laptop. So this is what my laptop looks like. Pretty much Chandler got this one for me, the sticker um, from Texas when she was there for her internship. And someone actually made this sticker like right then and there. So she got this for me as a gift. It went hand in hand with my favorite water bottle. Like, can you tell I'm like gay or, or not? Then next to it is one of my favorite stickers. It says, I'm not interested in being polite or heterosexual. This actually has to do with um, some Jesuit value. To thine own self be true. Um, and I just love it. I got it from Campus Ministry. And it's just a beautiful saying right there. This was last year's or a couple years ago's Unity sticker. So um, in case you don't know, I can do a whole video on that too. If you're interested, let me know in the comments down below. But I am the advisor to a club called Unity on campus. They are just this LGBT group on campus um, for allies and for pretty much all folks who want to come learn about the LGBT community or just be a part of a community. And um, it says Unity, Advocate, Educate, and Support. So this was their sticker that they designed. And it's so cool. And this was this year's sticker. So it's just that little logo without the, the explanation there. Then, next underneath it, I have the Canisius College sticker, and then I have the Hub. I went to California for the summer, and there's this place called the Hub, which is their multicultural, like, kind of center. Um, so that was really cool, and I met people there who I literally, like, am obsessed with. Like, I love them. 
So the hub was just an awesome place um, at Sonoma State. So instead of putting on a Sonoma State sticker, um, I just put on the hub sticker because I have so many like Sonoma State things. I have a sweatshirt, a shirt. Like, I'm all sonoma out. <laughs> But yeah, so that is my laptop, um, pretty much. And then Vicky, um, one of my friends from grad school, she got me this yellow case, so. Next I have, so I always have folders that correlate with my institution, but also uh, the classes I'm taking. So this year I'm technically in like three classes, which is internship, capstone, and my thesis course. But I have two folders here, so one of them, one of the, ooh, that doesn't even look good. My handwriting is not it. So right now I have two folders though, so I have capstone folder and a thesis folder. So thesis is where I put all my things for my thesis, my literature review, my re-edits, my sources are all printed out. And then capstone is more so um, any like handouts that we get, homework that we have, all the good stuff. So I like to just separate the two and make sure I have them both. Next is my planner. This is my planner. If you saw my plan with me, I'll link it down below. Um, I showed off this planner a little bit. And um back to school if you want to look at my back to school video as well you can look at that i'll link it down below too but i'll stop with the freaking promo okay on to the next section so this little section is like where the zipper is on the inside so what do i have in here i have little paper clips <laughs> the reason why i have these in my bag is because sometimes let's just say i forget to staple a paper or someone in our class forgets to staple a paper um instead of like folding it over i just give people a paper clip and like they can paper clip them together or if i forget to i can paper clip my papers together if i forget to staple it for whatever reason i have some peppermint lotion man this would have been great for the holidays and then i have this lotion from abercrombie and fitch so this came in like a set that actually one of my residents from when i was a uh, head ra my senior year of college got me she got me like perfume and then this lotion which was so beautiful and i still miss that perfume so lizzie if you're watching this thank you so much i love you i have gum in here in this little pocket just in case you know because just in case one thing I've learned is to make sure that you have some flint of ibuprofen. So now, it took me years to get with the with the situation, right? Now I have ibuprofen that I carry around with me in my backpack just in case someone has a headache or if I have a headache. And then the last thing in my bag, easily one of the most important, my headphones. So I have these AirPods. I actually won these airpods in um a giveaway on youtube shout out to nicole so that was really cool i bring these with me everywhere i just leave them right in there love to listen to music when i'm on my way to work anything like that or especially listen to the podcast that i listen to i really like to make sure when i am doing something i have that podcast going and i'm feeling good that is it for this video if you enjoyed please be sure to give it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and hit the little bell below just so you know when i upload a video much love Power to the people and talk soon.